Hello and welcome to the More Gaming fans, New England Chartriot fans. We are in the semifinals. So if we beat Melvin here today, we will be playing for the PML Championship next week versus either Morgan or Matt. They, they still haven't played their battle yet. But um, I brought a pretty similar team to how I brought before when I played Melvin. We did really good with it, so hopefully it can help us out again. He didn't bring Obama Snow this time around. He actually brought Al Creamy, but it looks like uh, his team's about the same. So, uh. Yeah, let's 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 see if we can take another win here and make it to the finals. Um, we're gonna go ahead and lead Aqua Fista here. Meant to soak up any physical hits, uh, get some stealth rocks off. We're gonna need them. Um, flip turn off course is possible. Have a good ice punch just in case he tries to lead uh, Salamance. We get a big chunk of damage off on that thing. And, uh, yeah, hopefully we can just get the rocks on the field, make them stay. And, uh, you know, it'd be great if we could set up like we did last time, but I think he'll be ready for it. So Cindy comes in here. And Aquafista hits the field. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to straight flip turn and go to Durant. He's probably going to try and toxic me. Oh, he's faster. He goes for the knockoff. So we do get some chip damage with Rocky Helmet. So he didn't toxic us, which is good. We get some chip damage off with Flip Turn. Still going to go to Durant here, because Durant can probably take this thing out. And that Cindy is leftovers. And we're just going to go ahead and go for the Stone Edge. Nothing on this team really wants to take this. But, of course, due to Hustle and the fact that, you know, Stone Edge does have a big chance to miss. We miss. And now we don't have a Life Orb anymore. But we're just going to click Stone Edge again. We still are hustle boosted, so we'll still do some really good damage. Hopefully take it out. He's thinking about what he's going to switch to here. And that means we get a free hit off on Bruce Lee. And of course we miss again. So we're just going to go to straight to free me day. That sucks, dude. So two misses with Flick. So the next time it comes out, it's just going to die. So we'll go to free me day here. Hopefully he's going for... There we go. Normal type move is good. And uh, we're just going to click Psychic here. Hopefully he doesn't swap back out to Mandibuzz because we have really nothing to hit that thing. But we do have a chance to Oko Bruce Lee from full. He might switch here. I don't know what to. Okay, he's going for the bounce. So that means our psychic is going to miss. But now he's locked into the, the, the move. Oh, we get some luck on our side. We avoid the bounce and get a Psychic off. Does it kill? It does. 56% chance and we got it. So free me day is good to go here. Needle Queen comes in. I do plan on Psychicing that thing as well. So let's go ahead and Psychic here. Okay, so he, he wanted us to do that. Because he goes straight to Cindy now. So real smart play on his part right there. Let's 
we don't really have a move to hit this thing. So we're going to go ahead and go to... Uh, let's go to Flick again. I don't think he has a move to knock us out. And Free Me Day still has potential in the back. So. Okay, goes for the Toxic, but since we're Steel, we avoid it. And now... We are free to max Rock Ball here. Alright, so he switches out. Goes to Needle Queen. I had a feeling I should have went Max Quake, but you know. On the off chance he would have stayed in, we would have done nothing. So, but better that we actually hit and get some damage than try to over predict and do nothing. But Durant is big and it's time to attack. Alright, so this gets the sand up, but we're both immune to the sand, so it's not going to help either of us right now. I'm going to go for the Max Quake. He could make the play to go to Mandibuzz or Salamence, but uh, I need to play it safe here. I need to get a kill. Yeah, he's really contemplating the switch, but he doesn't, so we do get the Max Quake off, and Needle Queen's no longer a problem here. Wonderful. So we do get a special defense boost. And now we are waiting to see what he brings in here. So he does bring in Cindy again. Let's see. Max Rock's fault hits everything pretty neutral. Just gonna do that again. I wonder if he thinks Cindy's gonna live it. No, he switches out and goes into Delmise. This should still do a real good chunk to Delmise. And does over half, so wonderful. And we also get some uh, Sandstorm chip damage off. I know for a fact he's going to want to Dynamax that Salamax. So I don't think he'll Dynamax here. We're just going to go for the Crunch. <sighs> Again, Hustle is going to be a problem if we miss. And we do miss. Alright, so we're living the Earthquake, so that means we have a chance to Oko this thing. And so far, it is not looking good for us on the RNG side, because that's the first hit we've actually got with Durant, <laughs> without being Dynamax. But we do knock down his Delmai. But since he has Dynamax Salamance in the back, it's still anyone's game. Alright, he knows the risk of us missing our Stone Edge, so he's going straight to Salamance here and probably going to get up a Dragon Dance, which could be bad. Could be real bad. But we do have a fell safe if it happens. Okay, he goes straight for the kill, which is better for us. He doesn't have a speed boost, but he does have an attack boost. So I'm going to go to uh, Killer Wasp here. And Draco Meteor knocks this thing out. He does have Al Cream he can go to. But uh, I don't think he will. So I'm going to go Draco Meteor. 
He probably goes big here. He doesn't. All right, he goes straight for the earthquake. We're gonna live with Focus Sash. I thought we'd be faster. Oh, he's Scarf. Makes sense. Draco Meteor takes this thing down. So Wasp special attack goes down, but we'll we'll get the beast boost to make it go up by one, I believe. And again, he still has maxing capabilities. Alright, so Cindy comes in here. And no point in playing around. We're just going to go ahead and go for the Thunderbolt here. Minus one. I don't think we knock it out. Not even close. And knockoff is going to uh, get us knocked out. So Naganadel came in and did what it needed to do. Okay, so... Cindy's on the other side of the field. I'm going to go Aqua Fist to here. And I'm going to start spamming Ice Punch. He's probably going to go for Toxic. Yep. And he hits it. So that's going to put Swampert on a timer. I should have went for Stealth Rocks because he can still flip-flop his team around a lot and with leftovers we're not going to be doing much with our ice punch so to play it safe we're going to go for stealth rock here and then we'll flip turn out go into drift bloom memento out and go into slurp up and try to set up from there if it's possible that's the plan that's the plan as of right now <sighs> okay he goes for the roost so we know he has roost and knockoff if he has foul play that's gonna be real torturous for us So Cindy here is going to try to uh, stall us out. Oh, he has Toxic as well. So Toxic, Knock Off, Roost. We don't know that fourth move. So predicted a hard switch, which we didn't do. Because, of course, we're going to go flip turn here. And you know what? I think we can just go straight into Chowder. Because Memento is not going to stop foul play. <sighs> foul play knocks us out though, I believe. Do I get greedy or just go for the hit? I think we could two hit KO with play rough. I'm just gonna play rough to scout out if it has foul play. Nope, it goes for the knockoff, so we could have actually got the belly drum. Go straight for the play rough. Almost knocks it down to where we need it to be. I'll probably roost here. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. So we're not going to get any health back. So we'll have to rely on living this next hit. Wonderful. He goes for the roost. But now we're belly drummed up. And should knock this thing out with play rough. 
All right, Cindy leaves the field. In comes Al Creamy. Play rough goes off and knocks that thing out. So all that's left of standing in our way is Mandibuzz. All right, Rocks chips that thing down. And I'm just gonna go for the Drain Punch. I'm plus six, it should kill. Oh no, he, he, oh, there we go. Dynamax is here. Now I feel stupid because I should have went for the play rough. There I go trying to play it safe. And Mandibuzz is here to Dynamax now. We go for the Drain Punch. We get some health back. But I don't know if we'll live this Max Darkness. Oh, we do. Wonderfully. Okay. Whew. That, I was more nervous than I was. I should have been. If that's the best move he has for us, I'll be it. Let's go for the play rough and knock this thing out. There we go. We have made it to the championship, baby. GG Melvin. And I will see you guys next week when we face off against Matt or Morgan.